Welcome back. A new recovery center in St. Augustine is helping transform the lives of men recovering from addiction. The Augustine Recovery Center opened about a year ago and already they have served and helped hundreds of men. They have and I got the privilege of stopping by the facility last week. I got to see how wonderful it is and I got to meet some of the people who make this recovery center possible. I had a pretty bad relapse. I overdosed and um, after some time had went by, some people got me in touch with Jason. And so um, I don't know how I ended up here, but for some reason I did. The Augustine Recovery Center was just what 24 year old Holden needed. I was just in the worst condition mentally I've ever been in in my life. Um, I was really suicidal um, and stuff like that. He struggled with a heroin addiction. I just had nothing left in me. Uh, I thought it was the end, and it, it was just so dark in my mind of what I thought was going to happen. Um, and now um, my life is so big, it's just I can't really explain it to you. He now feels on top of the world and thanks the Augustine Recovery Center for helping him reach this point. Co-owner Jason Chain has worked in several treatment centers and knew that he and his wife Lauren wanted to create a place that was one of a kind in the recovery field. Embedding spiritual practices, daily spiritual practices with like, practical life skills and keeping it small so everyone in here gets a lot of individual attention is probably the most important thing that we do and what really what we set about to do was to genuinely impact people where they will never be the same after coming here. It feels much more like a home than a recovery center. A beautiful home at that. One that can host 16 men at a time for 90 days minimum, most staying at least 100 days. We teach them all kinds of things like really how to take care of one another and how to take care of themselves and they get connected back to whatever, uh, I guess sometimes they get their first spiritual connection ever. Admissions and Outreach Coordinator Chris Blavelt says the men in the program stay on a tight schedule. They wake up, they, they do prayer and meditation, um, they do a work ethic, which is kind of like chores, cleaning their room, watering the garden beds. Then they break into breakfast and throughout the day they have group therapy, individual therapy, 12-step study groups, process groups, art therapy. And when they have downtime, there are plenty of peaceful, spiritual, relaxing activities that they can participate in, including a nature trail, a pool, beautiful views, and so much more. We work very hard at the physical health of these guys as far as like they work out with a personal trainer five days a week. Uh, we don't serve, we only serve refined sugar one time a week, um, no white flour. Uh, so everyone who comes here basically gains muscle and loses fat. So um, they feel good about the way they look. Program director Ty LeBain says the Augustine Recovery Center is like no other. They get a lot of individualized care. A lot of places sort of treat the uh, residents like, uh, or the patients, like it's sort of like a mill, you know, they just pump them out one size fits all type model. And we definitely have, you know, uh, specifically you know tailored individualized care for each of our residents to meet each of their individual needs because it's all the kinds of different personalities. Holden is now living a happy healthy life in St. Augustine after completing the program about three months ago and he's thankful for that individualized care he received at this special place. It's uncomprehendable at, at times. Um, the good things that have come my way since since I got here so it's it's been a good it's been great. It's like no other place I've ever been to, honestly. I'm Elizabeth Campbell for River City Live. It's just right around the corner. It is. And they also have a sober living program, so once people complete that 90-day minimum program, this helps them stay on that healthy, happy lifestyle even when they're out living on their own. And they also uh, work with people for different types of addictions, not just drugs and alcohol, but sex, food. They also work with people with PTSD, so much more. So, so they're changing lives. Oh, absolutely. And it, they encourage anyone who might be struggling or has a loved one who may be struggling, please reach out to them. You can find all of their information uh, at AugustineRecovery.com.